going to be about a revision. First of, first of all, we have to start the revisions from today on, okay? So, the sequence one is about me, universal landmarks, and outstanding figures in history, literature, and art, as you already know it. So, today, we are going to see the comparative of equality and inferiority. Good. What is the comparative of equality? We use the comparative of equality to compare people, objects, animals, okay? Which are equal in some way, okay? Which are similar or equal in some way. For the comparative of inferiority, we use it to compare objects, people, and animals as well, but which are not similar or not equal. They are different. Good. Let's see some examples. Pisa Tower, as you know, in the beginning of the year, we studied universal landmarks and monuments. So Pisa Tower, which is located in Italy, or we can also call it the Lime Tower, the Lime Tower. Pisa Tower is as famous as Big Ben. Big Ben is the clock tower situated in London. So, both places are touristic destinations. So they are very famous. Pisa Tower is as famous as Big Ben. Okay? So, Pisa Tower is famous. Big Ben is famous too. Good. So they are, they share the same quality. But, but, Big Ben is not, not as old as Pisa Tower. Here, we use the adjective old, okay, to say that Pisa Tower is an ancient monument. It was built in 1372. However, Big Ben was built in 1895. There is a big difference between them. So, Pisa Tower is older than Big Ben. Means they are not equal. So we use this structure, not as old as. I repeat, but Big Ben is not as old as Pisa Tower. You see? Good. A second example about the Statue of Liberty. This one, of course, is situated in New York, the United States of America. Statue of Liberty is as attractive, attractive as the Eiffel Tower. The Eiffel Tower is situated in Paris, France. So, these two are really attractive monuments, very beautiful. So, we use as, adjective as, because they share the same quality. Let's say they are similar or equal, somehow. But, but, the Statue of Liberty is not as big as the Eiffel Tower. Big or high, okay? So, the monument is bigger than the other. The Eiffel Tower is bigger than the Statue of Liberty in terms of size, when we talk about their size. The Eiffel Tower is 300 meters high and... Sorry, yes, the Eiffel Tower is 300 meters high. The Statue of Liberty is 93 meters. Okay, so you see there is a very big difference. That's why we use not as big as the Eiffel Tower not as big as. So as you see here, we use the comparative of equality and inferiority, okay, as adjective as for equality, not as adjective as for inferiority. And as you see here, it is okay for the short adjective as well as the long adjective. 
Okay? Good. See now the form. The structure of the sentence. We start with the subject. Plus, as, plus, adjective. It may be short or long. As I already said, short or long adjective, the same. Plus, as, plus the noun phrase. This is comparative of equality. So, as, adjective, as, is called comparative of equality. Subject plus not as plus adjective plus as and the rest of the sentence is called the comparative of inferiority. Okay, something is inferior to something else. Not as plus adjective plus as. Good, I think it's clear. Now let's move to the practice with some examples. I practice. This is task one. Fill in the gap with as or not as means fill in with quality or inferiority. Good. These are some outstanding places in Algeria, famous places to visit. Mount Lelakitum in the Ores Mountains is, here you have to put as or not as. You know what I suggest is just to take a piece of paper and a pen and you can do it now together at the same time, okay? You can take notes also. So, is, as or not as, here we have to find the suitable adjective, the right adjective. What are we comparing here in this sentence? What are we really comparing? Let's see here. Yeah? The height, the height, okay? The height of a mountain. The height for Lelekitu is 
one. Let's use the adjective big. Okay? The national park, Chiang National Park, is almost as big as the National Park in the U.S. Mountains. Good. The last example. The great, the great mosque of Yemen, which was built in 1082.
than tracking, you see? Making here may be more, more interesting than tracking. So tracking and camera mining are activities, okay? Activities that we do in the Sahara when you are on holidays, okay? Touristic activities. So, camera mining in the Sahara may be more interesting than tracking. So here you notice that these two activities are not similar, are not equal. So, what would be the sentence? How can you combine these two sentences? Have to say. Tracking. In the Sahara. Is. Thank you for watching. See you next.